When we're little, we never actually realize how smart mom actually is, how very wise she is, how very amazing, awesome she is. And today I'd like to chat through just a few of the marketing lessons I could extract from my experiences with my own mother. And I'm sure some of you and many of you, I would hope can resonate with these lessons as well. I just thought I'd highlight a few in honor of Mother's Day but also just because moms are just great all the time. Hello, I'm Andrea with the ABS Agency, here to bring you the very best in marketing and branding tips, as well as business tips for those of you who are entrepreneurs, small business owners, or those of you just working on your personal brand and your careers. Welcome, and thank you so much for being here. All right, so marketing lessons from my mother. I have so many I could extract, but I'm just hitting up the big ones, the big ones that I think are awesome to mention to you. So one thing that I got, one of the very first things I can bring to you about my mother is that she is a master delegator master delegator she is amazing beyond belief for those of us who are a bit of a control freak and it's hard for us to let things go my mom is so great at saying you do this you do this you do this and boom things get done i love it i still channel that today trying to think through you know what's the best way to involve people in that kind of thing so she is a master delegator and we need that in marketing you know because Truthfully, the entire company is the branding department. I'm elevating it to branding now, it's above marketing, but the entire company is the branding department. This is not a job for one person, one team. Everybody's gotta be on message, everybody's gotta be on point, everybody's gotta get it, feel it, it's culture, it's all of that, it's bigger than all of us, you know? And so, delegate do it all alone all right another great thing is pick your battles pick your battles that's a wonderful lesson in business in general but pick your battles you know you can't fight everything but the things that are worth really pushing for do it you know you got to pick your battles everything can't be a battle love that also this is probably the most golden nugget ticket golden nugget ever from my mother she is the master of delight the master of delight just made so many wonderful excellent experiences for us all along growing up and i'm pretty certain we were not super rich growing up but nobody knew that we didn't know that you know it's because the experiences were so rich and so much fun, you know, we just had so many great times together um, for Christmas. She would, you know, I remember one Christmas we sewed little ornaments, these little oriental fans with lace. She still has those ornaments. <laughs> you know, she can sew and all this fun stuff. We can, you know, go in the kitchen and help bake things. And, you know, just, she just involves so much of, you know, it, she involved us in so much of those fun, delightful experiences. So much so that it created a sense of community um, for those of us, you know, for our neighbors and friends and, you know, best friends and those who came around the house and the areas we grew up in Tallahassee and Columbia, South Carolina, Irmo, for those of you who know that area. Uh, now they live in Alabama. We have so many neighbors growing up that still think of my mother as like their second mother to this day. They just love coming around so much. And even now, my niece and nephews, at least the ones who are closest and live nearby, um, they are just the envy of so many other little kids <laughs> because everybody wants to go to Alabama because it's so much fun. And why? There's not the latest, greatest technology there. There's not all these video games and the, you know, wannabe hoverboards and whatever else going on, the latest and most expensive of technology happening. It is a country backyard and those kids get out there and have the best time ever. And when they come back in the door, they've got fun little snacks hand prepared and, you know, you just feel so special. You know, so that's part of the delightful experience is doing those little touches and things that make people feel 
special and loved and welcomed. The, the house was always just such an open, warm place um, and everybody wanted to be there. She just had the most supreme ability to make everybody feel loved and welcomed. And once you step through that door, you're her child. You know, So you are gonna get fed and you're gonna have a great time and you're gonna follow the rules like everybody else, you know? And so it's just like such a fun, loving sense of community, really, you know, if we think of it in marketing terms that she created. Uh, and, and still does to this day. And the other part that I really like about my mom in terms of marketing lessons we can extract is selflessness. The ability to make it all about others. And in the business world, that's about our customers. We're doing this around our customers. It's all about them. And so as a mother, and I think a lot of mothers out there will resonate with this, but it is, quite, and I'm not a mom. <laughs> Disclaimer, no, knock on wood, I'm not a mom yet. I don't plan on being one anytime this year. <laughs> However, uh, you know, she just made everything, it's just such a selfless environment. Everything is about everybody else, you know. And so that's why for things like Mother's Day, we just love to pamper mothers because they do so much for everyone else. And those are the things that endear people to our brands, B2C or B2B, business to consumer or business to business companies and brands. When we go out of our way to make others, others feel special and put others first, People always appreciate that. Those are the little extras that put us above and beyond in people's books, right? Okay, so be selfless. Uh, and again, finally, she had the master plan. She Not only is she the master delegator, but she's the master planner. So when Christmas was hosted at our home and all the aunts and uncles and cousins come over here, um, you know, everything was you know, boiled down to a science. She had the kitchen on lock, everything everybody's going to eat. She already delegated out who's doing centerpieces and decor, who's setting the table, who's making, helping to make what sides and all that. You know, and that's just a masterful planner. And so, and also there were backup plans. So if something went wrong or something didn't quite work out right, there were backup plans. Same thing in marketing and business. We have a master plan and then we have a way to steer that plan when it doesn't go right. If and when. So just a few of the fun lessons I thought about for Mother's Day. Happy Mother's Day, mothers. Moms, you are absolutely amazing. I can't even believe, I don't even know how you do your job. <laughs> I don't even know how you do your job. I get tired trying to take care of myself. And I look at mothers and grandmothers and everything they do and I'm just shocked and amazed. You're amazing, amazing, awesome. Thank you for helping us succeed in life. Thank you for all that you do, for getting us through the ups and downs and succeeding in the business world too. We love and appreciate you and you are adored. Mwah. Hope you enjoyed this. Again, this is the ADS Agency. Please feel free to subscribe. The button is down there you know where to find it and also click that little bell if you click the bell below then you'll get notifications every time one of these videos come out also follow us on our other social media channels we're on Facebook Twitter LinkedIn Instagram find us at the ADS agency that's T H E A T S agency all right and thank you so much for joining us we appreciate you have a good one out there and see you next time. Cheers.